You're probably thinking right now, hey, that title is stupid. Argentina did not win the Falklands War. And you are very, very wrong. Here's why. The Falklands slash Las Malvinas dispute goes back to the 19th century, where Argentina said that the islands were theirs because they inherited them from Spain, while Britain said they were theirs because they just always were. And then Britain sent settlers over at a time when Argentina was weak and without the military power to stop them. For like 130 years, Argentina complained about it but couldn't really do much else. Then, after the UN brought up the topic in the 60s, there were some negotiations that may have eventually resulted in some sort of compromise. But then, in 1982, Argentina had been ruled by a dictatorship of military generals for the last six years. The dictator at the time, Leopoldo Galtieri, he was all like, hey, we're really unpopular and we might have to give up power unless we do something really drastic. So let's take back Las Malvinas. So they attack them. And because the one thing that everyone in Argentina agrees on, regardless of political affiliation, is that the islands are Argentine, everyone just immediately forgot that the dictatorship had murdered tens of thousands of people, their dystopian social control, the complete lack of democracy, and the horrible economic crisis. But the dictatorship never expected that the UK would actually defend the islands. And that was a fair enough assumption. Because the British government back then didn't really care that much about some islands down way south, nowhere near them, which at the time weren't really known to have any natural resources, certainly not enough to go to war over. Or so it seemed. Margaret Thatcher, meanwhile, was gleefully ruining the lives of pretty much everyone in Britain who wasn't rich. While the Argentine dictatorship preferred more direct methods of murder, Thatcher was a fan of the slower and less obvious way. She denied people their basic needs and gleefully laughed as they withered away into nothingness. So as you might expect, she was not very popular at the time. So when Argentina invaded, she was like, God yes, War was literally the only thing that could possibly save me. So she tells everyone, now we're gonna attack and totally get the islands back. Hell yeah, Falkland Islands, British Empire baby, woo. And all the Brits, fresh from a hard day of not brushing their teeth, were like, wait, what's the Falklands? Oh, they're ours? Ah oh, yeah, we want them, we need them. British Empire, defend our islands, 100% ours. We might be out of a job and incredibly poor thanks to her, and she might have made it abundantly clear that she utterly despises us, but you know what? For the empire, for queen and country. We got to take back those islands on the other side of the world. Royal Britannia in it. We loves you, Iron Lady. The poor Brits just could not help themselves. Thatcher struck the British Empire circuit in their brain and that was enough. So Argentina's military generals are all like, oh crap. So we only know how to kill our own countrymen. That's pretty much all that we've ever done. We're really good at overthrowing our own governments, but how do we actually fight like, a foreign military. We didn't expect this, what the hell do we do? So the dictatorship decided to send in a whole bunch of conscripts so that they could protect the volunteer soldiers who had helped them out over the last six years by torturing and murdering people. Genius. Then there was a war in which about a thousand people total died. The British Empire won militarily and the Falklands slash Malvinas Islanders now hate Argentina more than ever and there's no way that the UK will ever negotiate on the issue ever again. The Argentine people were pissed as hell. Suddenly they remembered all the bad stuff that the dictatorship had done and they wanted them out as soon as possible. And so after its last ditch effort had failed, the dictatorship finally fell and Argentina returned to democracy. But the Brits, well, they all sang God save the queen and drank tea and didn't brush their teeth and you know, what else do Brits do? Oh, they also literally just like soak their dishes in a sink full of soapy water and then don't actually wash them properly. And that's it. That's another British thing. But anyway, they also completely forgot that they hated Margaret Thatcher. They forgot that she was making them poor and that she was committing mass social murder. And so they voted for her again. And then would you believe it? Four years after that, they voted for her again. Again! Oh, those poor, poor British sods. And that, my friends, is how despite what happened militarily, Argentina actually won the Falklands War and the UK most certainly lost it. The war brought down a dictatorship in Argentina, but in Britain, it perpetuated a witch-tatorship. Okay, video done, bye.